Welcome back to Sonic Unleashed. Uh. Hey, Tails. Tails was there the whole time, just hiding in fear for like 25 minutes. What are you doing out here? Sonic, is that really you? No. I can't blame him. Don't you know it's if like, you just if you just crouch happened? in a corner with your hands over your ears, eventually everything will stop. Tails is just like, who's this little shit? Tails is like, Sonic, did you become a furry? Sonic's already a furry. Well, yeah. <laughs> Come on, Tails. Although, if although you know, if Sonic were to be a double furry, this would be his first suit. <laughs> <laughs> Hell, <laughs> Chip, get the fuck out of this cutscene. Fuck, fuck off, Chip. That sounds like spaghetti. Uh, oh. Hey, mamma mia. Bada bing, bada boom. That sounds racist. <laughs> oh boy, guys, are you ready for everyone's favorite level? I'm not gonna lie. I stopped playing the HD version right because here. of this. I you, you know what? I I almost don't blame you. I I almost. was like I was You know like, what actually? Yeah, I don't auto blame you at all. I I cannot handle this bullshit. I don't want to handle this bullshit. I've already played this game to completion with the SD version. I don't care enough. Yeah, to do this. And you know, I, this shit sucks. And I so I that's probably why you can say what you want about the two versions, but you will be wrong. Because this exists right here. <laughs> no, yeah, no, this is this is worse than the fucking Sky Chase in Adventure 1, because while Sky Chase in Adventure 1 is boring, this is boring, but you also have to try. And like, pay attention. And also, it lasts like twice as long. Yeah, it takes Actually, forever. This is legit like five minutes long. At least now Sonic's aware of when that fucking claw arm is gonna come out, I guess. Alright. <sighs> because, for those who don't know, this level. It's all quick time events. Oh. Yay. I, I didn't want to remember this level. I, I remember getting a perfect on this. Good for you. Hee hee hee. How many times? It'll go up there. It'll go up there in your lifetime achievement list with S ranking all of Sonic 06. I was gonna say, how many times is Justin going to brag about something that involves self torture in this Let's Play? Well, I did. Our, I did also get all the gold medals in Sonic uh, 06. Did you get all the achievements in 06? Uh, I don't think I got all of them, but I got the more annoying ones. Why not just complete it? Oh. I don't know. I mean, uh, you've done all the bullshit. Well, I think one of them is the, uh, what is it, the very hard missions, and I don't think I have all the very hard missions. Hmm. I think they were like a DLC that you had to get, get separate. Well, I mean, those don't count, those don't count towards, like, completion. If they're DLC. Well, I, I guess that's somewhat true. I mean, I have a... Not 100% Resident Evil 6 with a Platinum Trophy. Yep. Whoops. Uh, oh, you're doing a little twirl. Someone wake me up when there. the game starts. Unfortunately, there really is no way to make this go any faster. By the way, uh, it was never explained... Nobody knows whatever happened to the other tornado, but now it's red again. Yeah? I, I don't fucking know, man. You're, you're asking for consist- you're, 
You're asking, you're asking for consistency in a Sonic the Hedgehog game? Continuity, rather? That's what I meant to say. Hey, can, can instead of this, we use the Sea Fox? <laughs> Wouldn't it just be this, but underwater? Shut up. It's the Sea Fox. It's infinitely more interesting. Oh yeah, you also have like a mandatory quote-unquote boss fight. Ah, uh, yeah, man. I will say, if you're good at the quick time events though, uh, I think the... Well, actually, no. The egg carrier is still easier because you can just sit in front of it and shoot it and it just be dead. This just looks like a revamped, uh... Uh, Egg Genesis from Sonic 06. This is the, uh, what is it, the Egg Culture, did it say? Yeah. Yeah, it's just, this is a fucking... Well, the way you kill it, it's it's a, a bootleg egg carrier. I mean, that's basically what this entire level is, is just, you know... Sonic 06, or uh, Sonic Adventure Sky Chase, but shittier. At least you don't get shot down in this one. This Sega game with... a stage where you have to press buttons... In a, before a video game where you have to press buttons fuck in a rhythm if Ooh. imagine pressing buttons in a video game this this was brought to you by connect gang you know this would this would fit in fucking project D that's what i was going to try to say before jack cut me off wait is this a project diva game i wish it was i mean me and cloud both have it I have it, too. I have one of them, at least. Are we gonna have a Project Diva face-off? No. I haven't touched that game in years. Oh, yeah, this this boss has a time limit, also. I didn't even see the time limit. Do you actually run out of time? No. God, no. Oh. Look at how much health he has left. Why, how, how could I possibly run out of time? You'd have oh, to really I, suck for I, that to happen. I, 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 I'm blind as a bat, and I'm sitting away from the television, so I didn't see that other one, so I didn't know you had another minute. Um, one thing that I did think to myself while I was, uh, while I was, uh, you know, editing one of these videos is that this game is really not easy. Like, really? in terms, I mean, just, I mean, you know, it's not hard. But like in the grand scheme of Sonic games, this isn't. This is like one of the harder ones. This is not good for kids, you mean? Yeah, it's like I like because you know this is you know you know it's a Sonic game, it's a kids game, so like I'm just kind of surprised at like how like difficult it is, especially compared to games that came before and after it. I want to. Well, I mean, I'd I'd like to say I want to know what fucking kid managed to get past Eggman Land because even I fucking struggle with that level. But, like, you know, it's pretty much the same as the hard bullshit we used to play, but still got through it. I mean... What was I going to say? Um, I'm, I'm talking specifically about the HD version, because I feel like the, uh, the, the Wii version isn't that bad in terms of difficulty. Like, no. I, I beat it, like, no Wait, problem at all when I was pretty 13. Balanced. Yeah, yeah. Well, isn't it, doesn't the Wii version also lack Eggman Land? No, there's Eggman Land. It's just not one giant level. It's yeah, just, I got. It's just another standard level where you have uh, a standard world, rather, where you have. I think it's like five Werehog stages that are like six minutes or so each, and then there's the one Sonic and then, level, and then one day stage. Yeah, but it's all broken apart. It's not like like one fucking hour long slog fest where you're switching back and forth between the two. Like, I died, like, six, maybe more times in Eggman Land, and I beat it in, like, 15 minutes, and I still got a B, and I'm like, Jesus Christ, what the fuck is the S rank? Are you breakdancing? Uh, kinda. You know, Sonic has a crawl that you'll almost, you're most likely never going to see unless you fuck up like a, like a duck? Did you just kick a child? Yes. Good. Kick it again. Listen, after what Jack had to go through, let him have his moment. Uh, that was not intentional, for let, the record. Let him kick a child, let him fucking da break dance, whatever he wants. 
The the hub world for Sonic Unleashed is actually the closest to like a Sonic Adventure game. Hello, small child. No hit her. <laughs> no. Nah. Sonic... She already looks like she was dropped on her head. Yeah, wow. your head is the size of your torso. Because in Sonic Adventure, you could technically hit people too if you jumped into them. Oh, hello. <laughs> Someone doesn't know human proportions. <laughs> Mr. America! Well, this is, this is when Sega decided to say, you know what, realistic-looking characters didn't really work last time. No, yeah, I think, like, you know, the, the human designs in this game are goofy, but, like, it fits, like, the Sonic world a lot better than, you know, the fucking real-ass humans from Sonic 06. Oh, no, it's fine. I'm just saying her hips like, are, like, ridiculous. Hey man, I'd rather, no problem with that. I'd rather make fun of these character designs and actually have them blend with the universe better than look at, at even one more human model from Sonic 06. I mean, I actually like I actually like these character models because they 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 remind me of like a Pixar movie, and I think it fits like the universe really well. Well, they're believable in a world with a big blue hedgehog. She looks like she's stoned. I mean, she's a college student. She probably I mean, is. <laughs> I mean, uh... Oh, this man. It, this man looks very angry. Also, those eyebrows. T take it as you will, but, like, I don't know if people might or might not be disappointed that, like, Unleash was, like, the only real game to ever use these models because humans don't really get much interaction past this game. It's because they realized Hubble would hey, Guys, it's Dora! Where's she exploring? Oh, God. Uh... <laughs> Dora went to college abroad, I guess. Hot, fat, too. Hot take. Dora, hold on. Dora was always fat. Anyway, continue. I think that the hub worlds in this game would have actually been decent if they were just handled better. It's not the they're fact... They're a bit it's, it's too not, big. It's not the fact that they exist. It's just that they're done poorly. They're just like a little bit too big. What? And also the frame rate is god awful in them. It was a little bit before the tremors hit. This old man Sonic stop body jacking. And a, and a whole pack of robots. They carry God, I remember seeing so many fucking YouTube poops from this cutscene back in 2008. Didn't Sonic at least spawn a lot of YouTube poop? Yeah, definitely. The hell's wrong with Chip's model model right now? I was gonna say the lighting looks kind of weird on his model. Well, like it's not affecting you. We can we can arrange that. Yay, he's dead. We did it, guys. We got like we got me, there. Oh god damn it! <laughs> for me, I actually did think that was kind of funny. Okay, <laughs> let's go and find the professor. Oh what damn it! He's alive. Chip? What, what is he? I don't know. A chipmunk? He's a god. I mean, yes. Well, spoilers, first of all, but yes. I don't it's, know. I it, can't tell what the fuck Chip is. It's like some, like, you know, squirrel pixie. Was the tail that short? He's roadkill. <laughs> I don't know. He looks like a chihuahua to me. And he's annoying In some like states, one too. he's a lunch. Now we have to go tell everyone the bad news. Yeah. There's literally no reason to ever feed Sonic Chili Dogs because all he gets is like a tiny experience boost. So really, if you want like all the achievements, you should feed them all the chip. Charp. Chap. Good day, old bean. Hey everybody, hello, hello, bad hello. news. This game is going to continue, and you exist in it. No, oh no. I forget, is Spagonia supposed to be Italy or Venice? Uh, it's like France, Italy. Oh. Wait, I mean, I, I get, I get, I get like France vibes from the accordion. If there was Spagonia. waterways, no, I would tell you it would be Venice, but it's definitely... It's... 
Spagonia is Italian themed. I remember it's a weird spaghetti it's not, themed. It's, it, it's not. It's yeah. It's not Venice, but it's it's it. It's, it's Italian. When do we get the the light dash suit or whatever? The light dash suit. Wait, the suit? The, yeah. You the mean the light speed dash? No. The when do we go buy the power up from the the shop owner? Oh, not for a while, I don't think. I remember where you had to basically spend a fortune to buy all those gems in Sonic 06, and like, most of them were useless. Yep. That's mostly I would Some of them were game breaking, about. though. Like the no, infinite the jump one? Game break the only ones that were game breaking was the purple one because of the infinite jump, and I think it was the, uh, the sky. The white blue. one. The well, I don't where think you it could was like, the white one. Yeah, there was. No, it was, like... it was the sky blue one, I think it was. That or whatever. Of. Where if you throw it, you literally just end up wherever it landed. So anyway, <coughs> we, we while we were talking, we learned some info uh, we... that something's fucking going on in Missouri. Oh. Well. The country, not the state. Well, we better go catch it. God, God help us if we have to go to Missouri, the state. <laughs> hey, at least Sonic doesn't have to go to Detroit. I would rather go to Detroit than Missouri. Oh. Oh. I mean, give Missouri some credit. It's not no. Alabama. Okay, true. <laughs> but it's close. Hey, it's, at least it's actually, it's, Florida it's like man's, right there. At there's least like, Florida man's not in Alabama. There's like five states that I could would I would consider worse than Missouri. Like yeah, like five. Let's see. I think I think the problem with Missouri is that there's just so many states that are just doing something better than Missouri that Missouri's so just forgettable. We talk about Cloud. I thought there were only forty nine states. Anyway, um, so here we are in Missouri, which is pretty obviously Africa land. It's one of the. I, I it is though. Oh, this he's acting. On drugs. He's he's acting really strange. These guys are on drugs. Oh. Yeah, this is definitely Africa. Ugh. You can't say that. Can't say what? Anything. Okay. Oh. But the, how, will we, <laughs> the rest, how will we LP? The rest of the Let's Play is just going to be entirely silent. It's just going to be the raw videos. And crickets. No, it'll just be a solo one because I offend everybody. This dude's name is Coffee. Now, you know what? Let's just hire the voice actor for Chip, and he'll just do the narration for the rest of the no. Let's Play. Yo. I mean, I'm sure he's a perfectly fine person, but no. I well, mean, he's that probably looking for a job. Anyway, next time on Sonic Unleashed, we're going to do the, the nighttime stage for Missouri.